Now with no plans to reimpose a curfew on Miami Beach, a proposal tonight from the city's vice mayor on how to prevent a repeat of last weekend's deadly spring break shootings. Vice Mayor Steve Miner wants a secure perimeter set up during select weekends near Ocean Drive. CBS News Miami's Peter Dench is in South Beach with more on that idea and how tourists are coping with the recent gun violence. Vice Mayor Stephen Miner is proposing that metal detectors be used around the perimeter, and he is requesting as well that city commissioners discuss this at their meeting next Monday. All this happens is some tourists tell us they are worried about their safety. I am a little worried about my safety given what's gone on and all the shootings that have occurred since the beginning of the year. Some tourists tell us they had hoped there would be another curfew this weekend after two deadly shootings in Miami Beach last weekend. Just given the climate, I think it doesn't hurt to take that extra measure of safety. Vice Mayor Stephen Miner is proposing that a secure perimeter be set up around Ocean Drive and the Loomis Park area on select weekends during spring break. We're seeing year after year gun violence. We had two dead this weekend. Same thing happened la last year. Different year, same result. We're going to have security checkpoints, metal detectors, canine dogs, and we're going to make sure that anyone who wants to come, come and enjoy our city, but you're not going to have illegal firearms with you. There is no reported violence Monday night, but South Beach is packed as groups pull up street signs, dance outside, and some people stop traffic. It's just hours after city commissioners vote four to three to not impose another curfew this weekend when the Ultra Music Festival will draw thousands of people to the area. Hotel owner Mitch Novick is concerned. We've had four emergency declarations uh, over the past four years due to the chaos and mayhem that is attributed to spring break. But Novick and other tourists we spoke with, like Lisa and Dan Derecki from Detroit, do not see the need for a curfew. I think you just have to be more careful of the areas that you're that you're frequenting. I mean, I don't I don't feel unsafe in this area right at the moment. And there is a proposal to put up more spotlights on Ocean Drive to make it less like a party scene. Now, despite the commission's vote, the city manager, meanwhile, does have the emergency authority to impose a 72-hour curfew if he deems it necessary. On Miami Beach, Peter Dench, CBS News, Miami.